The state government's denied making cutbacks to breast screen Queensland, saying the future of the service is assured. Concern quickly spread after a weekend newspaper article the Premier says was incorrect. The story in the Sunday Mail was met with shock and disbelief. Breast cancer survivors were stunned. I was absolutely horrified. I couldn't believe what I was hearing. Neither could the Premier, who quickly quashed the cutback claims. There is no way that this government will cut one single cent of funding for identifying breast cancer in this state or indeed treating it. Queensland's chief health officer says there'll be no reductions in the number of or budgets of Queensland's breast screen clinics. Free mammogram reminder letters will continue to be sent out to women aged between 50 and 69. So just to make sure that there's no misunderstanding, there's been no change to breast screen Queensland. But there will be management changes. Regional health boards, including the Sunshine Coast, will take control of mobile breast screen screening vans and backfilling for radiographers. Those local boards will be making decisions based on their budget and what they view as their priorities. That the Cancer Council Queensland will be vigilant on this matter. We'll certainly be robust in our uh, discussion with the government and we'll make sure that any issues, concerns that we have about this uh, are brought to the public's attention. Breast cancer survivor Carol Allen says lives depend on it. If they hadn't sent me out the regular mammogram checkups, I doubt if I'd be speaking to you today. They've definitely saved my life. Jennifer Nichols, 7 News.